All right, so you're in your garage, you're trying to remove your KTM Husqvarna radiator downpipe that's inside of the frame, and you're scratching your head going, how the hell do I get this thing out of here? Well, me too. So now that this is out of here, I figured I had a good opportunity to make a video to maybe help somebody out. Um, I was at the track, big puff of smoke, cut my ride day short, ended up, uh, my frame wore a hole through this radiator down tube. Um, so that's super lame. So I got it home, tore it down, had no idea how I was going to get it out. Um, but anyways, this is just threaded into this Y coupler. Just pipe thread right in there. But the problem is, is they glue it with whatever kind of compound. So it's kind of a, you got to get a lot of torque on it to break that glue. And um, KTM sells a tool that fits in those splines, the three splines in there, and you slide it in and then you're able to rotate it. Okay, well, I'm not buying the tool, that's dumb. It's silly, um, I'm only ever gonna use it one time, so. Uh, my solution, my redneck solution, was a 10 millimeter Craftsman socket, deep well, don't laugh at me, it worked, okay? It's outside of the bike, please don't laugh. Um, little grinder and grind slots into it. It helped that it was tapered here too, um, and actually, the slots actually line up with the um, points on the socket. So that was a good little guide. Doesn't have to be perfect, just uh, some kind of slot up to, the, up to the taper. And then you're able to take this and fit it in there. Slides right into the taper. And uh, it's almost like, it's like the perfect size. It was like it was made for that, so. Um, then you're able to get your wrench on there and then uh, so when you go to turn this you're going to be fighting these rubbers you're going to be like torquing on these rubbers and um, probably not going to get anywhere so I just took a thin screwdriver and stuffed it through the, the Y coupler to get some uh, good torque on it hold that hold that screwdriver tight rotate your socket break the pipe compound boom there it is and uh, on this two-stroke, it just fell right out of the frame. There was enough clearance just to slide it right out. And then now I have to figure out what I'm going to do to replace it, either OEM or aftermarket or whatever. But um, anyways, if you would just say a prayer for this 10-millimeter socket. She was a good girl, and she gave her life for dirt bikes. So we can respect that. Rest in peace. Good luck with your bike. Thanks.